Hello everyone, in this video, I'm going to show you how to download and install the MSI After Runner on your Onscreen PC. And also, I'm going to show you how to set up the Onscreen display so you can show the MSI all the CPU usage in while you're gaming. So first of all, you need to come to this website, which is MSI After Runner. Don't worry, I'll give you the link so you can download it. So you can download the final version or you can also download the beta. But it's better to download the final version. So you just need to click it. And it will automatically start to download in your PC. I have already downloaded this, so I'm not going to download again. So after finishing the download, you will get this folder. So this is a zip file. So you need to extract the zip file. So just right click on it and you will find an option called extract all. So just click on extract. And this will show you where you want to extract the file. So I'm just going to extract this on my desktop. So just click on extract. And as you can see, there is a folder of MSI Warner setup. So if we just double click to open this, and here you'll find the MSI After Burner setup. So we just need to double click to open the setup. Now we only need MSI After Burner, we don't need Norton 64 Gamer. So we're going to uncheck it and just click install and select language. So of course English, OK. Then click next. Then accept the agreement. Click next. And then you need to install both MSI After Burner and also the Revert to Static Server. So just click next. And this will show you where you want to install your files. I'm going to choose C program and click next. Then if you want to create a shortcut or not, but I want to create a shortcut because we'll need it. So I'm going to just click on install and it will start to install. And here you have to install the river tuner. So just click OK to choose the English language. Then click next. Then again, accept the license agreement. Click next. Again, why do you want to install? So I'm just going to choose the C program. Just click next. And again, if you want to create shortcut, so we can choose not to, but I will. So just click next, install. Then again, uncheck this show readme and you can run with the after runner now. So just click finish. And as you can see, here's the MSI after runner is successfully installed. But now you need to set up your MSI after runner. So to set up MSI after burner, you just need to go to the settings with the gear icon, as you can see. There is a settings option. Click on it. Then here you will find a lot of options here, but you need to go to the monitoring option. And here this is the option that you want, which is active hardware monitoring graphs. So there's a lot of options that you can use for showing in your display. But I would do only need the basic things that are GPU temperature, deep GPU use, APS frame rate, and also the RAM usage and RAM temperature. So if, if you want to select that, just highlight that, uh, that, that you want GPU temperature, then go down and here you'll find the option called show in on screen display. So just check that. And as you can see in OSD, again, I want GPU usage. I like that show in on screen display. So just do this for whatever you want. So I'm just going to go down and go for the CPU usage. You have to find the CPU usage with no number because those are the how many CPU or CPU core that you have. So you have to choose the CPU usage with which CPU usage with no number. Then choose the show on or screen display. Then again choose the frame rate. Now while choosing the frame rate, if you find that you cannot choose the show on screen display, first you need to check mark this frame rate option. Tick mark. Then you can choose this. So just then again, choose show on screen display. Now if you choose all the basic things that you need, now you can just click on apply and OK. Now the next thing that you'd want to do is customize your MSI after burner with River Tuner. So as you can see, if you don't find the River Tuner shortcut here, you can go to the right corner of the J icon. And here you'll find this icon the river tuner server so you just need to click it and here you'll have this window so i'm just going to minimize that and this is the tool of the customization of your msi after burner so as you can see there's an on screen display zoom so that means how much bigger or the smaller that you want to show the on screen display that you want to show you can choose bigger or small and also this is the color palette what kind of color that you want we can choose the bright color like green or red. So I'm going to choose green here. Click OK. As you can see, this is how you need to show it. 
So this is the basic setup. So I'm just going to run a game here to show you how this is going to show. As you can see in the left corner, this is how it will look. So this is how you can set up the MSI after Barra. So if you found this video helpful, please subscribe to this channel and thank you for watching.